Reading the poets has been the dullest of things. Even reading the great novelists of the past, I said, Tolstoy is supposed to be special. I go to bed, I read War and Peace. I read it, I read it, I say, where is the specialness in War and Peace? I really try to understand. I mean, and then many of the great poets of the past, I've read their stuff, I've read it. All I get is a goddamn headache and boredom. I really feel sickness in the pit of my stomach, I say. There's some trick going on here. This is not true, this is not real, it's not good. You see, poetry itself contains as much energy as the Hollywood industry, as much energy as a stage play on Broadway. All it needs is practitioners who are alive to bring it alive. Poetry's always been said to be a private, hidden art, not appreciated. The reason it's not appreciated because it hasn't shown any guts, hasn't shown any dance, it hasn't shown any moxie. Poetry is generally very dull, very pretensive. Uh, those who say the poet is a very private and precious person, I don't agree with. Generally, he's just a dumb, fuddling asshole writing insecure lines that don't come through, believing he's immortal, waiting for his immortality, which never arrives, because the poor fucker just can't write. Most co poets, coets, hoets, carrots, can't even write a simple line, like the dog walked down the street. Nothing should ever be done that should be done. It has to come out like a good hot beer shit. A good hot beer shit is glorious, man. You get up, you turn around, you look at it, and you're proud. The fumes, the stink of the turds, you look at them, you say, God, I did it, I'm good, you know. And you flush it away, and then there's a sense of sadness when just the water is there. It's like writing a good poem, you just do it. You, you, it's a beer shit. Nothing to analyze or nothing to say. It's just done. Got it? I really hate reading worse because you're really getting up there. You've written poems that you really meant alone, you know, by your typewriter. And then there's this crowd out there drinking beer and all that. And you're reading it to them. The writer has no responsibility except to jack off in bed alone and, and type a good page. Why, well, I continued writing, even though it came back and I got drunk for 10 years, I felt there was nothing out there. So I had to continue because they were so bad, not because I was so good. And I'm still not so good, but they're still very bad. There's still room for somebody to step in here, you see. And I hope he arrives, or she. That should be enough right there, with that bundle of 55 poets. That should cure them of their malady, but it won't. Good night, goodbye, and happy reading.